G'day and welcome back. So today in this video, I thought we'd talk about multiple timelines in DaVinci Resolve. So at the moment, I'm currently re-editing a short film that I did a few years ago, and I'm doing a fresh color grade on it. I didn't do the original color grade, so I thought I'd go back and have a go at doing my own grade for it. Now, I ran into a bit of a problem where I needed to change a certain part of the film, but I didn't want to change too much. So I wanted to copy that part and put it into a new timeline so I can edit, but still have the original just in case. So if you don't know how to do it, what you want to do, let's make this a little bit bigger, is come across to here and click this little icon. And then you want to be in this part here, so timeline view options. Click that. And it'll give you stacked timeline. Now, as you can see, we have a little cross here to put in another timeline. But if we want to put one underneath, what you do is come across here to this little folder with a, another cross on it. Click that. Now, as you can see, we have a fresh timeline. Now, I already have timelines in because this is where I edit my YouTube videos in this certain project. So what I could do is I could come down to select timeline and I could choose any one of these if I wanted to. And then as you can see, now we have two timelines. Of course, you can make them bigger so you can rearrange it. But let's say you didn't want to do that. You can just cross this off. And if I'm working on a sequence and I don't want to change the original just in case, in case I forget what I've done, I can just copy this, control C, come down to this timeline here, press control V. Now, as you can see, we have this sequence here is down here. Now, this is really handy when you're editing because let's say I changed this all around and I didn't like it, then maybe I forgot how that edit went. I can just make a fresh timeline and do a fresh edit. And if I like it, I can just get rid of this and put this back in here. So a really handy tip. Hopefully it's something that helps you guys out. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. I've been Drew from Gingo Productions.